Okay, Valorant, we need to talk. Valorant has been taking nothing but else this entire week. With the beginning of patch 6.11, Valorant nerfed a bunch of different things, but along with these nerfs came a lot of glitches. But before we get into these glitches, I did want to bring up, am I the only one who thinks the shorty nerfs were really unnecessary? Listen, I understand the shorty is good close range. It's a shotgun. It should be good close range. And I even understand that it was only 150 credits, so bumping up in credits might be necessary. But having the damage increase, I personally think was very unnecessary, even though it was very minimal changes. As a raise main who uses shorty quite a bit. I probably only experienced one clip where I was like, okay, the shorty's actually broken. But I was curious on what you guys think. Were the shorty nerfs necessary or not really? So personally, that was Valorant's first big L. But along with these shorty nerfs, a lot of us also been experiencing this hot mic glitch. Which basically, if you talk in game, sometimes your mic doesn't turn off. And even though this can lead into some very funny content, I cry, man. I'm very surprised that Valorant has not fixed this. How are you? I love girls. They're so funny. Valorant, let us talk shit about our teammates in peace, please. And even though the shorty nerfs were an L, and as well as the hot mic being such a big L, the biggest L of them all is the night market being canceled. Yes, you heard that correctly. Night market is completely canceled, at least for now. On June 7th, a lot of us experienced these weird glitches, where apparently there was this bug that was causing crashes when you open your night market, which caused Valorant to having to look into some maintenance on it, and for a brief time, put it on pause. But because of the fixes were way more troubling than they thought that it was going to be, Valorant decided to cancel it completely. They did say on June 15th that we'll have an up Update to see whether we're gonna have the night market or not this time around. But personally, Valorant just seems to keep taking L's. I really hope Valorant ends up taking the responsibility and maybe give us a little increase in discounts for the inconvenience. Or maybe Valorant just throws the Prime Karambit and Ion Vandal in my shop, then maybe I could like look past this. But in all honesty, this kind of makes me scared for this upcoming episode since Valorant has plans to bring in new currency, a brand new game mode with brand new maps, and a brand new progression update to get XP. And yet they're still having problems fixing the hot mic and as well as the night market. This isn't looking good for us. But maybe I'm just being paranoid. Don't forget to subscribe and follow for more updates. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And always, happy Valorant.